welcome all viewers and first of all i would like to thank you all for supporting this channel english solutions unconditionally and today's topic of discussion is the subject verb agreement or subject verb concord this is a general rule in english grammar that subject must agree to the following verb so we will discuss this that subject it may be a noun or a pronoun should match in a sentence with the coming verb again i am repeating that subject and verb must be in agreement so this is known in general that is the subject verb agreement or subject verb concord examples are there she dances every day here she is singular dance is also singular usually verbs in english are in plural so for making them singular we have to add s r e s they play cricket here the second example is they play cricket they is plural and play is usually in plural form so that is agreeing here the boy is running i am reading rohan and sohan are classmates but in the next sentence slow and steady wins the race here one rule you have to remember that if two singular subjects are joined with and and express one idea then singular verb will be used so you have not to get confused here and each of his son is sharp minded each is standing for one another example bread and butter is his favorite breakfast this is again the single idea the poet and patriot has come these two are referring to a same person if it would have been the poet and the patriot then the condition would have changed the news is correct news is singular jury the jury has seven members actually jury is used in both way if it is referring about the collective noun then it will follow a singular verb and if it is mentioning about the members it will take plural verb 10 kilometers is a long distance a pair of shoes is lying on the floor certain words are looking plural but they are treated as singular there are five boys in the room if sentence starts with there then the following subject will decide the number of the verb the jury have different decisions here jury is mentioning about the different members about the case the jury have different decisions about the case one more example 2 and 2 make 4 and one more example you he and i are three friends this is a very important sentence if you have to put all three subjects numbers or persons like then 2 3 1 this figure you have to remember second person then third person then first person and the verb will agree to the first that is you according to you here r is mentioned so this is very important you he and i are friends you have to repeat again and again to learn this so before concluding i would like to mention some key points about the subject verb concord wages politics means they are looking plural but they are actually singular verbs second both few many take plural verbs third is when two singular subjects are joined by or or nor then singular verb will be used and if they differ in number then the verb will be according to the number of the later verb this is very important point means if they are having two choices those are joined by or or nor then they will be arranging the verb according to the later verb this idea you have to bear in mind this is very important point and this have to carry throughout your learning next point when the subject is a relative pronoun then the last verb must agree in number with the antecedent of the relative pronoun antecedent means which is coming before the relative pronoun one more point singular verb is used with a collective noun this you have to remember always and last and very important point if two subjects are joined by with along with as well as then the verb must agree to the first subject means one example is here that he with his servant is going to the market so this was a very brief brief learning about the subject verb concord and i hope you have understood it very well thank you all 
प्लीज लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब इंग्लिश सॉल्यूशंस चैनल